the Justice Department and the FBI. They've wanted most of what was in the, uh, the Patriot Act for years, and they couldn't get it. Congress explicitly turned them down. And so when they saw the climate that was created after 9-11, they said, let's dust off you know, everything that, uh, that we wanted, and we'll just put this out there and say that it, we need it for, to catch terrorists. And uh, they, you know, they, they just got everything they wanted. If it weren't for Dick Armey sunsetting uh, part of the, uh, the legislation, uh, you know, we, we would have no, no control over it because you, you can never repeal this stuff once you get it on the books. The part of the Patriot Act which uh, allows the, the government to detain immigrants uh, worries me less than those sections which pertain to American citizens because uh, immigrants don't have any particular right to be here until they become citizens. And, uh, but there, there is a point at which uh, I would change that uh, point of view uh, just in the context of human rights. I mean, uh, you know, you don't want to give government the right to uh, hold somebody forever uh, without any kind of explanation, w without charges being filed. Uh, well, you know, what's the difference between that and what they did uh, in the former Soviet Union? Uh, so, you know, if, if they're doing it for a reasonable period of time, uh, which I would define as, uh, you know, a year or a year and a half, something like that, uh, all right, fine, I don't have any problem with it. But if it goes beyond that, then I have to think, what, you know, what's being done here? I'd worry about uh, Hillary Clinton administration uh, simply because the kind of attorney general that she would appoint would likely change the definition of what a terrorist is. You see, um, right now, uh, the law gives the, the power to the attorney general to determine who the terrorists are. Well, this attorney general has limited them pretty much to uh, the sorts of people we think of that uh, uh, you know, are plotting to uh, blow up the country. But uh, uh, if uh, Hillary Clinton gets in and she still believes there's a vast right-wing conspiracy, uh, she may well say, uh, well, uh, these uh, right-wing groups that uh, are against government power, you know, particularly libertarians and so on, uh, they really are terrorists because they, they don't uh, support the government. And all she has to do is have her attorney general change the definition of, uh, uh, of what uh, a terrorist group is, and uh, suddenly, you know, we become the terrorists. <laughs> and, uh, you know, I don't exactly relish that idea.